Kia ora, internet. I'm at Tangiwai, which was the site of one of New Zealand's worst rail disasters in 1953 when a lahar came down the river and swept out a rail bridge and the train didn't know this had happened and went right over the bridge and killed 151 people. It's, yeah, a name that I think every New Zealander knows is Tangiwai. I learned about the Tangiwai disaster in social studies at primary school and I always imagined it as being this massive big gorge but it's just like an ordinary little bridge over an ordinary little river and obviously this is a new bridge it's not the one that collapsed but this is where the bridge was it looks such a peaceful river at the moment but that volcano in the background has a crater lake and when the crater lake bursts it sends massive amounts of water down this river and that's what happened in 1953. Yeah, so it was one of those flash floods is what caused the Tangawai disaster. There's a little walkway which takes you up to this viewpoint above the bridge. It all looks so innocuous. Just a gentle stream and an ordinary railway bridge. Apart from the giant volcano on the horizon. The sun's setting so we're going to have to move on soon. Don't forget to do all those nice internet things like liking and subscribing and leave a comment and I will see you next time. Ka kite anō internet. Of course all of us here knew people that were supposed to be on the train or that we didn't know yeah. whether they'd caught it and they started giving names out later in the day and I think most New Zealand just just huddled around the radio that yeah. Christmas Day listening because it was so horrific.